Find the good way. With the other gym. <laughs> Not the original one. But, uh, yeah, we are October, um, was it 1229? I, I forgot. October 27th, 2024. Got my roller. Um, I need, I, I went to the bathroom twice and, uh, third time like I feel like I still have to go but I'm like whatever so I might be a bit gassy I guess I got up at like seven something went to bed at like 12 something or one something I don't yeah like one something I think so I didn't get that much sleep but I'm like I might as well stay up and uh I have uh, an appointment later that called. Um, but no, but me we we're messaging, you know, for massage therapy. I, I, did I mention I was thinking of um, going back to getting another massage therapy course? I haven't called, I haven't had time. I'm all over the place, sort of. But. Anyways, so I had to message him, I had to say, um, I don't accept cash because I can't accept direct um, bank transfers because <laughs> my bank account is frozen, which is something I've been procrastinating on. I have to call them Monday, tomorrow, you know. But, uh, what did I get done? I made sure I got at least one. I got February 2024 bills that were already scanned in an envelope. Compared it with what I had scanned already to see if there was anything missing. So I got that done. And I wrote that down in my Google event, calendar, whatever. And, um made an extra note that I had to, uh, you know, take that file and transfer it into my hard drive so I have a backup. But then I deleted it off uh, cam scanner, which I'm never using again because they charge. So I have to adapt the way I scan because if I use notes, you can only do 24 pages. So, um, yeah, that's another note to scan more um, bills that I keep accumulating. And I could do it in parts because I can't keep a full file of like a hundred uh, papers or whatever. So I guess it kind of works. Um, but that was the last thing I did kind of before I left. I did some laundry and it's in the dryer now. That was just kind of spontaneous. And... made pancakes and had those too. Don't know where I'm gonna get more protein because they don't have it anymore. When I was at Canadian Tire recently. So there's that. Had one pre-workout, gonna have the second one. I'm on two right <laughs> the past few days. So this is my, you know, fourth day or so of things spiraling down. Um, saw some videos from uh, Crappy Childhood Ferry. I think that's the video the channel and uh, you know about avoidant personalities and I put them into my Facebook group take back your life and DL that kind of helped me you know sometimes you get you look at these things and they help you or sometimes you look at them you're looking to be validated for what your uh, thoughts are I see the gas is coming uh, it's not gonna be that good for the gym. I may have to, you know, see how that settles down. But, um, yeah, because the one guy I was having, you know, sex with, and, you know, I blocked him, then I removed him, and I'm like, 
I'm so over it, you know? And that video was perfectly describing it and perfectly describing a lot of people <laughs> I encounter, you know? But, who's that? But at the same time, got me down. And then also think about my frozen bank account and I have to deal with that. And what am I gonna do with money? Is that? But all compounded with lack of, you know, less sleep. You know what I mean? There's that. So one thing at a time. But the, the thing is, I'm keeping my routine. Going to the gym. That's. I don't even have a choice. I don't have days off per se. I have work days and I have gym days. Kind of works for me right now. And I spent time going over my, what I'm gonna do at the gym and I highlighting it, you know? And then, like I put a, a lot, like you know when air, airports, airplanes, airplane companies overbook, and then, depending on who shows up, <laughs> so they don't lose money, you know? Um, so that's kind of what I'm doing with like, cause it's, if it's a day or so, It's like it's getting it to a point where some, a lot of my muscle groups are recu recuperating, but then when I go, have to go back to the gym, I can't do all that in one shot, plus my flexibility, plus this. Um, so then I have to do a big inventory of what I, I want to do, and then I have to go into what's more priority, and then when I'm in there, I have to see what I can actually handle. And tomorrow I have another workout day, and then Tuesday I have work, and then, you know, and then another two days or three days off, so I have to plan for that in advance, <laughs> you know, but it's like one day at a time, and see a little bit into the future, and then sometimes pan back and think about the, uh, the big picture, you know, but then scan in close and think about the, uh, the present, you know, go to the gym, get what I can do if I'm not strong, switch exercises that uh, will not take as much, will not train me, you know. <laughs> um, yesterday I managed to transcribe my November schedule for work into my Google. I have to verify it with the actual email that gave the dates to make sure that I have the right dates. I have to verify a few times. That's important. <laughs> but I have 12 work dates. So it's like three times a week. So that's the first time I had that. And because I'm teaching one class in English and because I'm teaching two uh, um, daycare classes, they're long. You can't cut them short, really. So, but it, the pay is the same, that's the thing. Um, but it's a different vibe, it's different people. And it takes more energy out of me, but it's kind of fun because the people are more engaging. Whereas the ones I do during the week, sometimes the people, like the last one I gave at this place, CPR first aid class, it was all kinesiology students. And I was like, oh, okay. I didn't mention that my, my that's what I do, you know, it's my exercise science degree that I've been working off for, for many years uh, until presently. But there was no, no I, think, I think kinesiology right now, because um, it used to be there was kinesiology, the, the science part, and then there was the gym teachers, the, the, the ones who were not uh, dum-dums. And I think I, I, that's what I encountered today. <laughs> or they were just really socially retarded. Um, it was like that. So it, it was not a very good interaction. It's like, yeah. Um, and I never got around to answering that comment that was like three, like a, a, a book. Um, and, but I did look at it again, like I glanced over it, who, who it was, and I thought it was a woman writing it, because 
because of the agreement, because, you know, the, the interaction type thing, and so I thought I was dealing with a, a woman, but then I see it's a guy from the name, and it says doctor, I don't know if you're a doctor, but, yeah, I don't have the time for that, it's just, I gotta be in the right mind space, but anyways, off to the gym, here we go.